private company in Israel has become a valuable source of potentially life-saving information for its clients. The information is intelligence about potential terrorist attacks. Correspondent Mike Tobin explains. The attacks of September 11th, the Madrid train bombings, the London tube and bus bombings were all preceded by planning and pep talks on the internet. Cyber chatter conducted by violent Islamic radicals. All of them are online, uh, using the internet to uh, uh, transfer information between one another. So now there is Terragence, an Israeli company comprised mainly of former intelligence officers from Israel's army. Their job is to surf jihadist chat rooms and websites undercover and intercept communications. They're fluent in Arabic, Farsi, and Arabish, the cyber language used by jihadists in the chat rooms. Intelligence agencies uh, in the U.S. or in Europe don't have that many linguistics experts that do have intelligence understanding and they are not as internet savvy as our guys are. In addition to monitoring communications, Terrigen sleuths intercept videos which teach bomb and rocket manufacturing, many glorifying attacks against U.S. forces in Iraq. Investigators then work to find who posted each video. When you do the link analysis, that's where you can start finding results. That's where you can start finding the traces of the activists themselves. In the short time we were at this facility, these cyber sleuths intercepted the beginnings of a plot to attack American interests. The communication promoted attacking American oil facilities in Algiers. It had satellite maps from Google Earth attached pinpointing the targets. That is uh, now being processed, uh, translated. Uh, and that gets forwarded to? Yeah, forwarded to uh, intelligence agencies. The company charges intelligence agencies for the info they relay. But that's what keeps this small group of cyber spooks undercover, online, and mingling with the jihadists. In Israel, Mike Tobin, Fox News.